you are a strong, capable man with the world ahead of you. <laughs> and I love you so much. Nice try, Connor. Connor, I am at a loss for words today. I'm excited, I am overwhelmed, but above all, I'm just so happy that I'm standing up here beside you. Sarah, just under 11 years ago, I walked into my first summer job at 500 Consumers Road. Long haired, white, glasses, California shell necklace wearing kid that had no idea what cool was. It's no surprise that when I was introduced to the other summer students sitting at the picnic tables outside during lunch, you wanted nothing to do with me. Fast forward a year to summer number two. Throw in a few Jays games, some office messenger flirting, and becoming your personal parking valet, things started to shift in my favor. The next 10 years of my life would be the best years of my life. Not because we traveled around the world, not the amazing concerts, the Leaf games, countless cottage weekends and Florida trips, and not because together we raised a crazy puppy. They were the best years of my life because they led me here to this moment. Sarah. He said there's this great girl at work he's been talking to. She's cool, we get along well, but she's the boss's daughter. I know I said proceed with caution on that one, and I'm so glad you didn't listen to me. Sarah, thank you for being the best thing that has ever happened to my best friend. You're amazing, and I couldn't be happier for the two of you. makes me want to be the best version of myself. You are exactly the person I need in my life and the only person I would want as my husband. Thank you for making me talk when I say I don't need to talk about it. And most of all, thank you for always loving me every day without hesitation. I can't begin to explain the excitement, joy, and bliss this day brings me. You are truly one of the most beautiful, passionate, and intelligent people in the world. Sarah. I can't wait for a lifetime of love, adventure, traveling the world, building our careers and raising a family. Now it's the first time to introduce to everyone Mr. and Mrs. Sarah Beaumont and Connor Kennedy. very exceptionally special and unique woman who gives me something honestly she gives me something to feel proud about her virtually every day but I wish you and Connor nothing but happiness from here on because you guys absolutely deserve it I love you guys we watch as this relationship has really blossomed over the years you can see the respect that these two have for each other Sarah you really really make my son very happy 
and there's nothing more than a parent could ask for that. Dean and I absolutely adore you too. Cheers to best friends, sisters, sister friends, and soulmates. I most certainly wish Lori was standing here uh, beside me, and I'm very sad that she's not, and we all wish that. But if there's one thing I do know about Lori is that she would want this day to be about these two very special people that we're here to celebrate with, and that's what I want to do. I wouldn't be able to stand up here today without mentioning my mom, who I know would have been really, really happy to celebrate with me today. Since the moment she met Connor, she absolutely adored him. I don't think she's ever said a negative thing about him. She was so happy that I found my person and she was such a big part of making today happen. I wouldn't be who I am today without her. So for that and for everything else, I can't find the words for her. I just wanna say, mom, I miss you. I love you and thank you. And I promise to love you unconditionally for the rest of my life. Now, what I can't promise is that I'll lay on the couch with you every night and binge watch every episode of Friends. <laughs> but I do promise that when the rain starts to pour, and like I've been there before, I'll be there for you.